Hi everybody, my name's Shark, and welcome back to The Last Door, Chapter 3. Alright, let's see if we can wrap things up this chapter. Alright, some crazy stuff's starting to uh, get, get, get going. Okay, what's this? A pile of ragged clothes caked with mud and full of holes. You want to use it with the bows? And thinking, funking mistletoes? What's this? The dead roots of a once great tree fill the cavernous sewer. A strange green moss covers its surface, and there is a great crack along its length. The ticket? And no. Okay. Is, is this where I put the violin? Is this. this. Mm hmm. The violin has disappeared amongst the roots, as if swallowed up. The trunk seems to be expanding. The noise came from above. Wow. Okay. A pile of ragged clothes caked with mud and full of holes. Is that Daphne's outfit? Sir. There's a note partly obscured by mud. I mustn't fall asleep. Okay, yeah. Oh, whoever that was was eaten by rats. It's over here. Fall asleep. Do not fall asleep. That would be good. What's. Oh, okay. They ain't getting creepy, man. They ain't getting creepy. Alright, where, where was the exit? Was it here? Down here. There we go. Ooh. Okay, that's a problem. Paper sheet captured the branches is now within my reach. Oh, that, that's all? That's all you had to do to get it? You, I mean, you just couldn't get a stick and just, you know, get up there and just pull it off? You had to make the fucking tree grow gargantuan, put holes through everything in everybody's houses? What the hell's wrong with you, man? What the hell's wrong with you? People paid mortgages on that shit. People have to pay for those damages. What the fuck is wrong with you? Good God. Seriously, dude, just to get, just to get that. On the page is a strange poem. First into the wind, they sought for the king. But lost were the birds, they wept in suffering, and flew to the sea, compelled by a need. They found their silence, their quest was complete. Ask of the halo. Hey Van Gogh, Van Gogh, Van Gogh, where are you going? Come back. Hey, I, I want to talk to you. Who the fuck do I know that's got red hair? Oh. Right. Oh, what's this? What? Did I screw up? I got lost in the fog. If I am to make my way through, I will need to orient myself somehow. Oh, great. Okay, this might take a while. Ooh, you're big. And who might you be? You're not gonna move, are you? That'd be creepy if somebody was just like creeping behind me this whole time. Expecting anything at this point. Oh, hello. Well, he just vanished. What the... What the hell? Uh-huh. Your ticket, please. Uh, this one? 
Oh, uh, I don't know. Thank you. Please come in. That's it? I've been chasing you this whole time? Oh. Was that statue of him? Who's the third guy? What? Keeping an eye behind me. Hello, Jeremiah. I knew you would find us eventually. Welcome to our humble performance. You were there. You were part of the group. You don't remember my name, do you? I am Alexander. What is all this about? What do you want from me? From you? Nothing, dear Jeremiah. It is you who came here searching for answers. It is the same as when you joined our group. We each came with our own reasons. Do you remember yours? True philosophy. Indeed, it was our thirst for knowledge that threw, drew us together. No one w waits for us out there, dear Jeremiah. There is no one who will care for us when our hour comes. We had been alone until now. How did I end up in London after being buried in the boarding school? The bird protects us. It is by his design that we should meet again. But we are not the only ones who take shelter beneath his wings. His influence and power is ever expanding, ever reaching. Do you not feel him beckoning? I only want to wake from this nightmare. This is no nightmare. This is a show, a performance. The truth we seek lies beyond the curtain. Now we have crossed the point of no return. The lights are on the stage is the lights are on the stage is set, and soon you shall meet the actors. Welcome. <laughs> 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 oh, I don't like this cast very much. This belongs to you. No, thank you. I'm out of here. I, I want to go now. Maybe. Can I leave? They're, they're not looking at me, are they? Oh, I have to take the mask, don't I? Oh, man. I don't want the mask. That's it? Just here, Dr. Vakefield. If you are reading this, then you have followed my instructions to arrive at the agreed upon address. Good! I apologize that I could not accompany you immediately. My own investigations have deemed a certain unanticipated degree of attention. I have determined that your patient's patient David is in serious trouble. I will contact you with more information post haste. In the meantime, discretion is the utmost importance. Your friend Johan Kaufman. Does this good? Yeah. The adventure continues in chapter 3. In chapter 3? You mean chapter 4? This is the third chapter. What the hell are you talking about? Whatever. Okay. Well, that's it for chapter 3 of The Last Door. Um, not as much as a, you know, as the last two. Was the first one like that? Yeah, the first one was definitely like that. Not, not as much. I mean, that was creepy. But yeah, we'll see what happens in the fourth one. So yeah, 
All right. Well, if you liked what you've been seeing, uh, give me a like, comment, all that good jazz. Uh, so yeah, until then, that's it for me, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Adios!